All right, everybody, we're back with uh, part three for Hellboy Asylum Seeker, or Dogs of the Night. It's got two different names. Um, we are in episode five now, which there's six episodes in total in this game, so we're getting very close to the end already. Uh, we've got Colin's staff now. We just fought him at the end of the previous part. He deceived us. He sent us back in time to retrieve an amulet to stop an eclipse, but it turned out we were giving the amulet to our enemy instead. He's got a brother named Mitri, so I think that's... I think we thought we were giving the amulet to Mitri, because uh, Peter, the guy we've been looking for in the beginning that was found dead, he was also trying to get he was trying to get info for Mitri. So Mitri, I think, is Colin's brother. We just haven't fully seen him yet, but there's more to this game than we don't know yet. I don't really know what the hell's going on half the time in it, but we're ready to continue here. Let's see what's in store for us. I haven't actually been able to use Colin's staff in a straight fight yet. I got attacked in this corridor before. I don't know where the enemy even came from. We have no items. Oh, it lights up the hallway, though. So we actually have basically a light as well. Yeah, I wonder what that... Right at when I was recording the outro for the last part, I got attacked in this hallway. I don't know where it came from, though. I'm not seeing anything in here. This hallway is way too long. Alright, now we're somewhere. It's just the same hallway, but going the opposite way, I guess. Oh, damn. This was an instant one-shot on it? This thing is very powerful, then. I tried fighting one of those things before, it took a bunch of punches. We're in god status now. Oh, I see how the cooldown works though, it starts sparkling again when you can shoot another orb. the hell are we now? Oh, we're back outside. Um, here's the thing though, I don't know where the hell we're supposed to go. Oh. I think this was locked before. I guess we're supposed to go this way? Oh, what the hell? There's a whole village here? Yeah, it's weird how some areas have blocky trees and other areas don't. Yeah, screw you. Wait, do I get hurt when I use this? Or was that flash for dramatic effect? Hell, well, you missed. I found the amulet, but the Nohawks Canis have found me too. I don't feel safe with it. I've stashed the amulet in the old church, keyed to the music below. I'll retrieve it once I'm sure that Mitri's all right. The amulet should open the way to hell, or close it. Way to go, Peter. Where's the music? All right, so now we're looking for a music sheet. All right, well, Peter was already on this mission for a while, then. What is this, zombie town? Well, the zombies don't really stand a chance anymore. I like how they wither up. Alright, here's a save point. Oh, 
We got, we got we have to put our staff away whenever we do something. Anything over here? The thing I hate about the fence texture is that... Oh, there we go. The music matches Peter's note. The thing I hate about the fence textures when because we needed to pick up a wrench behind a fence before, but as you can see, it doesn't have any transparency. There's like a box that blocks out what's on the other side of it. Not sure why it does that. Not seeing anything else. I don't think we can go through any of these. Nobody home. I'm surprised we can even interact with them. Come on, staff. Hey, here's some help. What's going on? Whoa, is that a super zombie? Uh-oh. He walks a little bit faster. Oh, is he immune to this? Blocking me. Jesus Christ, how much health does he have? There we go. I think we're clear of him. Why is this wall texture different? Guess we just only have one way to go. Oh shit, wait. Is this the same area we were in all the way in the beginning? Do I have to go... back? I know if we take the elevator... Oh, I didn't mean to go this way fully. But I know if we take the elevator, it leads us back up to where the organ is. Which I guarantee is where we have to play the, uh... Musical sheet. Oh, the fire is gone. But I'm just curious what's all the way back here now. Like, how far back can I actually go? Never know where they're going to throw an item. Huh. Speaking of which... There's some health. Yeah, we can't go back this way. Alright, I'm going to head back to that elevator then. Alright, here we are. This door has no knob or key. Yep, I know, we got to rotate this. The elevator sound effect, but we should be able to play that music sheet now.
How about that? Oh, what the hell? There's the amulet. This looks familiar. All right, got that now. Guess let's just get out of here. I feel like this game, see like the trees aren't blocky here, but I feel like this game was supposed to have more going on, but they had to like cut some stuff short. <laughs> Mainly probably because of budget or something, because it feels like we're just fast tracking right now. Anything further this way? No. Well, that one big monster we fought in the past, it did show up beyond this gate before. What the? Feel like it's gonna show up again. Oh wait, never mind. This is one of the Nohawks, Kata, whatever the hell they are. This is the dogs of the night. Huh. Alright, so the staff works on this thing. Holy shit, this one's fast. Wish we had a quick turn. Not today. If I just keep running around him in a circle, we should be good. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Son of a bitch went down nice and easy. That was crazy. That was an intense fight. <laughs> I am being sarcastic, by the way. I know my tone of voice doesn't really change no matter what, but... Yep, we took it down. Alright, so... Where am I? Am I just going... Back? This was a dead end before. Because we are heading towards the asylum again. But... Can we actually go back into the asylum? No, the asylum's actually locked. locked. So, now where do we go? Back through the town? Which I think was through here, right? Oh, great, the zombies came back. At least we got our trusty staff. I wish when it did the explosion, it would have, like, area of effect. Made a noise like I picked something up. Yeah. Thought there was another one behind me at first. Let's save again. Try to pull the staff out. I think I'm going the right way. You know what? I think I think I know where we're supposed to be going. I think we're supposed to be going to where that fire pit was again. But now that we played the organ, the way's open. So basically, we're just going the long way around. 
that one zombie gonna come back? No. Alright, we're good. Yeah, here we go. I think we have to go back to that center chamber. From the looks of things, I'd say Callum's portal is open. Maybe I can do something about it if I hurry. Hello down there. Hellboy. Sarah. 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 I'm coming to get you. Gotta say, these cutscenes are just a 10 out of 10. This isn't a swirly portal this time. It's just a red clouded one. I wonder if we're going to hell. We just jumped right into this. Dude, our horn screw back though. What am I supposed to do against this thing? Ow. No! I don't get it. Is he attacking in a pattern? Not today, orange demon zombie. Like I said, I think we're just like, jumping around so fast now. Aha, okay. I guess this is what we're doing. Taking his legs off. He's gonna attack me? I guess so. Dude, these, he's attacking in such a weird pattern. Oh, they're immune to this. Oh, God. Jesus Christ, they comboed. Oh, the fire hurts us too. Definitely don't want this equipped. Fire, you son of a bitch. Why is fire even hurting me? We got one more of these. Oh. I don't even know if you can avoid those. Oh. Dick. And this one's a blocking master. At least you can stun lock me by doing quick jabs. Alright, let's see what this does. Oh, they're gonna make me run after Sarah still? I'm coming. Right. I hope this works. If it doesn't, I guess I'll see you later. Yeah, I guess so. 
Sure, but we have to get out of here. How? I think I know. Oh. Ow! I could do without the falling thing. It's not so much the falling as the landing. <clears throat> you get used to it. Hellboy, we'll need the bureau to send someone for Peter. We owe him a great deal. He led me to you. What he must have seen. What was all that about? The twin brothers and the amulet and those things? The only thing you need to know is we won't have to worry about this whole thing for another 666 years. Come on, let's get out of this place. There we go, we beat it. This is actually going to be a pretty short part. It's going to be like 20-something minutes, but... I didn't expect episode 5 and 6 to go so fast, so I think my suspicions were correct. I think they probably wanted to do more with this game. They just couldn't. Like, maybe they didn't have the budget for it, but... we That final boss is just destroying some legs. I mean, this, like I said, this game is not good by any means. I'm just playing through Hellboy games because I figured I might have. I might as well because we're going to be playing the new one and I knew this wouldn't be a time dedication or anything like that. It's not that hard. Uh, they do start to give the enemies a little bit more damage near the end so you die even faster but to be honest the hardest enemies in those game in the game are those tiny little bugs in the sewer or the like possessed orderlies inside of the asylum really early on. There's only like three of them though and they, but they just hit really hard. But yeah, I mean, I I could play through this game again at some point in the future and be okay with it. Like I said, it only takes four hours to beat the game, so it's just like a fun... I guess fun isn't the right word. It, it's just an entertaining game to just get through. It's, it's, it's just so goofy. The combat is very basic. Things happen so fast. Episode 5 was literally just running in a circle, basically, and... Oh, now the music cut out. But then, and then the boss fight was literally dedicated to all of Episode 6, so... Very quick game. Uh, yeah, not a very good game, but entertaining nonetheless, especially if you just like Hellboy as a character. It's just cool to be able to play as him, but there's the end of the credits. But yeah, uh, the next game we're going to be playing is going to be Hellboy The Science of Evil, which is another somewhat older game it came out on ps3 and xbox 360 back in the day i think it was a psp game as well um that's also probably not going to take that long to get through i think it's longer than this game at least but only by a couple of hours um so yeah that one's a little bit better but it's still not that great of a game but then after that we're going to be playing web of word which i've actually been kind of excited to play that so as always thanks for watching and i'll see you on the science of evil